Hi there! FileVault disk encryption helps keep organizations safe by preventing unauthorized access to potentially sensitive data. As JamfNow administrators, we should be familiar with how to manage FileVault on enrolled computers, as well as how to access or recover data from a FileVault enabled disk. A FileVault recovery key allows us to access a FileVault enabled disk in case the user forgot their password after a long time away or if the user is no longer at the organization. Let's see how to use a FileVault recovery key in Jamf Now. I have a Mac Mini which had FileVault enabled by a Jamf Now blueprint. Before I try to access the disk, and ideally before I need to access any computer, I should make sure the recovery key has been stored in Jamf Now. I should also confirm that the computer is checking in regularly, in case there have been any changes to the recovery key. In Jamf Now, click Devices, then click the computer in question. Under Last Checked In, confirm that the date is relatively recent. Then, under Data Protection, ensure that FileVault is enabled. Click Show Recovery Key to verify that the key has been uploaded and securely stored with Jamf Now. If Jamf Now shows that FileVault is enabled but does not display an option to show the recovery key, we may need to have the computer generate a new key to store in Jamf Now. For more information on this process, take a look at Generating a new FileVault key for escrowing with Jamf Now linked in the resources. All of these look correct for this Mac Mini, so I know I'm ready to unlock it. When I turn the computer on, I'm prompted to enter the user's password, which will be used to unlock FileVault. I don't have the credentials of this computer's previous user, but I do have the FileVault recovery key, which I can use to reset the account password. Click the question mark to the right of the password field and choose Restart and Show Password Reset Options. Note that you may need to enter an incorrect password up to three times for the question mark to appear. After the computer restarts, enter the recovery key and click Next. Select the FileVault enabled user and click Next to reset the account password. Click Next to complete the password reset, then click Restart. After the computer restarts again, enter the new account password to unlock the encrypted disk and log in. Now, what if this key didn't work? What do I do? In this case, FileVault is doing its job, protecting data from unauthorized access. If I don't have the credentials of a FileVault enabled user or a valid FileVault recovery key, the only way to use this computer is to erase it. For more information about reinstalling macOS, see Apple's How to Reinstall macOS article linked in the resources. That's all there is to using a FileVault recovery key in Jamf now. Thanks for watching.